Hey guys, welcome back to the next episode of Final Fantasy VII. Um, in the last episode, um, we managed to free Eris, and um, I guess our new party member at 13, only to get immediately captured. And But now things have kind of gotten uh, taken a bloody turn, so now we need to figure out what the heck is going on. Um, yeah, like, look at this, this is crazy. Like, come on. Come on! Thank you. Alright, so... Yep, let's head up the stairs. See what the heck is happening. And... Ow! Oh. Uh, is he dead? Not gonna lie, that's kind of anticlimactic for this guy. Not gonna lie. He's dead. The head of Shinra is dead. Then the sword must be Sephiroth's. Sephiroth is alive? Looks like it. Only Sephiroth can use that sword. Who cares who did it? This is the end of Shinra! Uh. Oh. It's the fatty. No. Please don't kill me! What happened? S Sephiroth came. Did you see him? Did you see Sephiroth? Yeah, I saw him with my own eyes. You really saw him. Uh, would I lie at a time like this? I heard his voice, too. Uh, he said something about not letting us have the Promised Land. Then does that mean... The Promised Land really does exist and that Sephiroth's here to save it from Shinra? So he's a good guy, then? Save the Promised Land? A good guy? No way. It's not that simple. I know him. Sephiroth's mission is different. Oh, yep, he's there. He goes. Rufus! Shit, I forgot about him. Who's that? Vice President Rufus. The President's son. Oh, great. So our Shinra shit isn't over yet. Um. So. Yep. Let's head out here. So, Sephiroth was actually here, by the way. Just who are you? I'm Cloud, ex soldier first class. I'm from Avalanche. Me too. A flower girl from the slums, and a research specimen. <laughs> what a crew. Well, I'm Rufus, President of Shinra Inc. You're only president because your old man died. Correct. I'll let you hear my inauguration speech. Oh, good. Father tried to control the world with money, and that worked for him. The people believed that Shinra would protect them. Work at Shinra, get your pay. If the terrorists attack, the Shinra army will help you. It looked perfect on the outside. But I do things differently. I'll control the world with fear. It's too much to do it like my old man. A little fear will control the minds of the common people. There's no reason to waste good money on them. He likes to make speeches just like his father. Get Eris out of the building. What? I'll explain later, Barrett. This is the real crisis for the planet. The hell's that supposed to mean? I'll explain later. Just take my word for now. I'll go after I take care of him. Alright, Cloud. Alright, so... Everybody's heading back down. Cloud, I just thought of something. I'll wait for Cloud. Everyone, get to the elevator. Okay. Hmm, it's going to get pretty ugly from here on. We should check on our equipment. So, yes. Cloud and Tifa's materia. Go ahead and take it off, because you can just put it back on later. Um, so. Uh, we got Eris back in our party. Um, actually, hold on. Let's do that. Um, let's go ahead and equip the carbon bangle. 
Um, go ahead and put on some magic materia on her. Excuse me. Um, what am I doing? Why am I doing it like that? That's stupid. Sorry. Restore all. Uh. Oh no! I, I didn't mean to do that. Um. I guess it doesn't matter. Lightning. Oh. Uh, let's just get the enemy scale off for now since I can't learn anything anyway right now. Uh, I give him all the hands. On just for experience, and I think that's I think that's good enough for now. Uh, yeah. No, I think we're good. So now. Back down the elevator. And oh, fight. Okay, so yep, we got this guy. We gotta take him out. So yep, so basically, he's he's a machine. So take him out. Um, Bear can actually hit him since since he's got the long range weapon. So yeah, just take him down with limit breaks and fire and magic, basically. Um, yeah, so we'll just do this. Um, and artillery. Bolts, fire. I guess I could compare the damage just to see. Uh, bolts. Says a cannon charging, that doesn't sound good. Um. Oh, oh, he's dead. That's nice. Okay. Uh, oh, there's more! Great. Um. Oh yep, more lightning magic. So, let's take this dude out. Ow. Yeah, it does about the same. So, I guess just. Uh, let's take him out. No longer range attacks. It's basically the exact same as the last boss. Honestly, not really much to worry about. Um, so yeah. uh, okay. Oh god, he's going full can can on me. That I hope that doesn't mean anything. 
going body blow. Ow. Okay, I might need to start healing now. Um, let's go with this. Nope, oh, he's dead. Okay, perfect. Alright. Alright, they're taken care of. Got a mythical armlet. So, um, let's see. Should we do? Um, I will actually. Yeah, I'll do that. Take material off, and I will go ahead and equip Cloud with some stuff. So let's. No, not that. There we go. Material. There we go. Um. Gonna do. I'll put on poison. Uh, lightning. Uh, fire. Ice. Oh no, that was the right skill. God damn it. Uh, oh. Fire. Nice. Excuse me. And. I think we're good, Chi. So, let's go. Why do you want to fight me? You want the promised land in Sephiroth. That's right. Did you know that Sephiroth is an ancient? Whatever. I can't let either you or Sephiroth have the promised land. I see. I guess we won't be allies. Alright, and yeah, now we fight Rufus. Now, first things first. Kill the dog. Kill the dog thing. Um, before he does anything crazy. Because he'll keep buffing Rufus and that'll just be annoying. So, now we can focus on actually taking him down. Rufus isn't too hard. Um, you can cast poison. Um, he does kind of do a lot of damage, but if you can heal yourself, you should be okay. Um, go ahead and use the limit break here. Ow. Come on. Well, we heal after this turn if he doesn't die. Yep, he's poisoned. That's all for today. Alright. I don't think he's getting ready to get away, but. <sighs> Guess it could have been worse. Level up, yay! Protect Vest and a guard source. I think guard source permanently raises up defense. So, that's cool. Um, so, did that. We're gonna head back inside. Go back downstairs. Um, up oh, wrong way. Dirt. Anyway. And we'll reunite with Tifa. Where's Rufus? I couldn't finish him. This is gonna get complicated. So, yep. Right back down. I'll go on ahead. Oh. Damn, we're surrounded. If I was alone, this wouldn't be a thing, but I got a reputation to protect. You all get out while you can. It's not you they're after, it's me. Yeah, well that ain't happening. You got caught up in this over Marlene. Now it's my turn to help you. Aw. Okay, playtime's over, jackasses. 
Thank you, Mr. Barrett. Aw. Who are you calling Mr. Barrett? That don't sound right. Well then, if you're through talking, may I suggest that we think of a way to get out of here? Huh? Oh, oh yeah, you're cold, man. Just like someone else around here, I know. Did you say something? Not a thing, so what are we gonna do? Barrett! Oh, looks like they're here. Oh, it's just Tifa, though. Where's Cloud? Everyone, over here. Uh, what's up? Where's Cloud? He's coming. Hurry, hurry. Then <laughs> we get a fucking Akira bike scene. Like, come on now. Oh my god, does Tifa have jiggle physics? I didn't even notice that. That's really funny. That's awesome. That's awesome. Um. Okay. Oh, yep. Yeah. So we're getting ready to make our grand getaway. I also I don't know why they have this stuff even in this building, but whatever. It's time to get the heck out of here. Control the bike with the D-pad and save your friends in the truck from the Shinra Pursuit troops. So, X, attack on left, B, attack on right. So, first off, let's form a party. So, yes. Back to this. And, let's equip materia. So, now you're gonna wanna have some lightning materia for this, for this upcoming fight, because we are getting ready to fight another boss. So, I will put the lightning on you. Um, also, if you can, um, I would go ahead and put elemental fire on somebody's armor, because the boss, upcoming boss also uses some fire attacks, so you'll want to go ahead and have that on. Uh, you're already good, so I'm just going to... I don't know. Fire... That. No, god darn it. There we go. Uh, okay. Let me. Make some, oh, yeah, let me take the material off of you. Put it back on red. Oh, it's already off. Um. Well then. Okay, I'm trying to make sure I don't start the fight by accident, because that would be annoying. Alright, so... Lightning. Fire. All. I'm gonna put steel on you. Steel. Excuse me. Um. That doesn't matter. Put that on for filler, I guess. Um. And. I think we're set. So, yes, let's go. So, yeah, basically, you gotta stop them, gotta stop the Shinra goons from attacking your party. Honestly, uh, kind of a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> like, it's very obnoxious. Like, come on. Oh, there you go. I'm t I was literally like right there. Come on now. Um, there we go. All right. Oh, I didn't even notice the portraits are blinking too. That's kind of cool. Why aren't you dead? Thank you. 
Come on now. It's easy. I think it's easier to hit them from the right than the left. Come on, man! Get on my nerves! Oh my god, you have been here for like five hours. What are you doing? Thank you. Good lord. Come on. There you go. <coughs> oh jeez. This is taking f this is taking f and oh. And that was unnecessary. Um Is that it? Are we done? Yep, I think we're done. Okay, so yep. Believe it or not, that dude right there is the boss. So, yep. Basically, basically, the health determines how much health you start with for this boss. Um, and believe it or not, this is actually a back attack, so you want to make sure you um have them positioned, have them positioned to where they won't take double, they won't take too much damage. So. Yep, another machine, so you know what he's weak to. So, uh, yep, more lightning. He actually resists fire, too, so that's also another thing to keep in mind. I'm gonna go ahead and heal everybody first. So, yep, just knock him out with some lightning bolts. So... Actually, you can just attack. So, I let everybody is at full health, so I can go ahead and hit them with some magic. So, when he changes forms like this, he'll use fire skills. Um, yeah, his fire skills honestly kind of hurt a little bit, but, um, especially one. That he d especially another one that he does, but thanks to Barrett having that, having his um, fire resistance, um, it doesn't do too much to him, so I'll at least have somebody alive in case anyone bites it. So, that should, that should help a little bit. So yeah, just keep hitting him with, just keep hitting him with some thunderbolts. I'll try it just to see. And yep, this is the form change. So, come on. Oops. Let's Another twin burner. But yeah, as long as you keep everybody's health in mind. No, oh, damn, that did a lot. Um, I guess I should just be doing that. Um, uh, nope, he's dead. There we go. Um. Yep, he's taken out. We'll grab another star pendant. Well, what do we do now? Sephiroth is alive. I have to settle the score. Will that save the planet? Seems so. Then I'm going. I'll go to the things I need to know about the ancients. Many things. I guess it's goodbye, Midgar. Yep. Let's talk to you. I'm going back to my hometown. I'll go with you as far as that. I guess it's the start of our journey. 
hate traveling? I don't know, but I don't have anywhere else to go, so I guess it doesn't really matter whether I like to travel or not. Eric? We told Eris's mom to go somewhere safe, so Marlene should be safe too. Yeah, she should be. She said she didn't want to stay in Midgar anymore. Maybe it's for the best. Eris? You know what? This is my first time I've ever left Midgar. It's dangerous. You sure you want to go? I thought you'd say that. And I guess with that, our Midgar journey has finally come to an end. So I guess with that, we close on the first chapter of the game. So next time, we'll finally see the world outside of Midgar, and we'll see what we'll be doing next. So I will catch y'all later in the next episode. Take care.